Welcome in to Caven Point in downtown Jersey City to play for tonight's Hudson County soccer matchup between the Dickinson Rams and the St. Peter's Prep Marauders. Trying to find Cyril there. Was no crap, but that's going to be intercepted by Thomas Montero. He has beat Thomas Montero. Thomas Montero has a good touch. Save Ward. Wow. wow. What a play there by Thomas Montero. But that's his first save of the contest for Neil Ward. That was an amazing save by Ward. I don't think that he's... He didn't think that that ball was going to get to him. No, that was, was kind of very dusable. Solid job so far up until this point. But it's going to be a long free kick for Derek. And she went on target right there. It's Ward for his second save. And that'll be grabbed there by Ward. Save number three. Some of Ward's aspects, uh, some of the aspects of his game that I really like. Him being able to come out of the box. Or Almost to the border of the box. Just he's very aware. In the box, uh, a Neil Ward able to snatch that one and make the save. Mr. Took a little I bit of contact as well. Mr. Ireland just showing his grit, absolute grit from winning a gold medal. He's got it in him. Love to see that from Mr. Ward right there. That is save number four for the senior in that much shield there. Marinella will send that one headed away by the Rams. And that will do it. So, for the first half of play at Caden Point in Jersey City, we're scoreless between the Rams and the Marauders. It's Kucharik. Box. Try to find Osorio. Here comes Thomas. Long range. Off target there. That's going to go out of play for a goal kick. Nice boot from Thomas there. I like to see that at those aggressive shots. So here's a story from about the 20. Four man wall for the Rams. Sorio. In the box. Again. Ooh. Field goal once again good on the other end. Keep, uh, it's going to be another goal these. kick. Ojeda. In the box. Novella right there to make the stop. Snuck right under that wall the Marauders had built, but Novello, stud there. Ball in the box. Montero cutting in. Nobody had him from the Marauders, but Novella able to make the grab. Christian Duarte delivering the header. But here come the Rams. That's a nice touch shot. Novello able to get there for the save. Nice Never block, do. Novella. Nice play there by Blaylock. CPV able to intercept. CPV finds Janice. Janice going to find the middle. Sayo will. Try to cut there. That's a great play. Tomas Montero. He's off on the counter. It's a good ball. It's going to be Ryan O'Donnell. Who gets the first? Novello on the clear. Absolutely an amazing play from Novello there. Novello the able to time that one first and gets there before Ryan O'Donnell. Looking for that goal. Asks me a push from behind. Ball in the box. Montero, there. Here comes O'Donnell out the touch. Long range. There's Novello. Save number four in the second half for Anthony Novello. Nice grab by Novello there. Blocked away by the Rams. That's going to be cleared all the way down to the Marauder end. Manello with a poor touch to Amadou. Amadou with a good touch. He's going to go one-on-one. -on -one. Amadou to his left. Amadou, save Novello. Oh. Ball still not cleared yet. Rams able to keep possession. But Fogola to his left. Tries to find Amadou. Poor clearance off the touch. But it's going to be a three kick against Kraft. But save number five for Anthony Novell could not come at a bigger time. Another amazing save from Novell. Just getting his body in front of the ball. Much needed save there. And can the Marauders get a counterattack? No, they cannot. It's Tomas Montero in the intercept. Montero still has possession. Finds Amadou. Amadou! Novello stretches out for that one. Anthony Novello is light out right now here in the second half. That's save right. number six for Go. the junior netminder. He's brewing for the Marauders. You can almost feel it. They're just getting aggressive and got the crowd on their side here. Kucharik tries to find Syro and does. Syro with the turn. Field goal good again, but just high and wide. Thomas Duarte. Back, CPV, and the box, trying to find Janice. Janice on the header, wide, and a goal kick. CPV heads. Montero finds Amadou. 
who is not outside, play continues. Hills O'Donnell to his right. O'Donnell, say Novello. <laughs> Corner opportunity for the Marauders. Kucharik over the ball. Charik in the box. Header, yeah. and it's a goal. Oh, goal. It's Chris Marinello. Chris Marinello wins it in overtime. Double overtime. And it's another set piece that beats Dickinson. Wow. What a game this was between two Hudson County foes. It's Kucharik on the set piece, finds Marinello, bangs it in, and once again, a corner, a header, beats Dickinson. What a game, Iggy. What a game. What a game. The crowd's going crazy. The environment was great all game. Marauders stay true to themselves the end. Beat Dickinson on the corner kick. Great finish for these Marauders. And so we give, give, give some thoughts on that play, Sawyer. I... <laughs> I'm honestly at a loss for words. That just happened so quick. Perfectly set ball. Marinello was there. Right place, right time. Perfect finish. And I want to also give a shout-out to Anil Ward and Anthony Novello. A little combined shutout to help prep this win here today. So the 91st minute of a possible 100 total minutes, it's Chris Marinello off the head, delivers his third goal of the season, none bigger for him in that one. And the Marauders go to 11 and 1 on the year. What a game. Shout out to Anthony Novello with a seven save performance in the second half in overtime to keep the Marauders from allowing a goal in that one. A new award with four saves. Also, shout out Noah Montero from Dickinson, six saves as well as the Rams fall to six and four.